Hi everybody, this is the left-handed shooter. And today we're gonna to take a look at my Ruger Wrangler 22LR. Okay, this is the this is Ruger Wrangler. Let's move this out of the way here. Okay, these things come in uh, many different colors. And uh, when I was gonna buy this, I actually wanted to get the copper one, but I bought this like during the height of the pandemic and uh, there's no inventory on anything. So they, but I found this one, this is tungsten, which is pretty cool. You know, it's got a four and three quarter inch barrel. You know, it's got fixed sights, it's grooved in here. So you're not doing any adjustments. Single action. Um, to load this guy, for one thing, it is, it is empty. There's nothing in there. This one to load it, you just, when you, when you pull the arm back, you could, you can, this thing freeze, this, this, uh, the cylinder spins freely. So it makes it real easy. And then, then you have this guy right here. Oh, pull everything out. And to take it apart or take the cylinder out, you just pull the button here, pull it out. And she'll pull right out. And basically that's pretty much disassembled for the most part. Put it back in here. Let me line this thing up right here. This does work easier than this. There it goes. All right. Okay. As far as safeties, there's no there's no external safeties on this thing. It does have a it does have a bar here that that blocks the blocks the trigger. You know, um, and this is Cerakoted, finished Cerakote. It's got it's got plastic grips here. And what's cool about this gun is you can uh, the the Ruger single six uses uses the same exact grip, so you can you can change these grips with a million of those different things. And let's see how much she weighs here. Twenty-eight point eight ounces empty. And you know when uh, its biggest competitor, what everybody compares this to, is the Heritage Rough Rider, which I have right here. It's a very cool gun too. And it's specs are, are roughly the same on this gun on, on the Rough Rider. What's different about the Rough Rider is this one this one acts like like to load it, you have to click it. You can't go back and forth like, like you can on like you can on the Ruger. And I'll give you my pros and cons against both of these. You know, these are my so I think. The pro on the on the Wrangler is build quality. Build quality is pretty darn good. Rough Rider, I mean, it's it's not horrible, but compared to this one, it, it it's not it's not as good. Pros also on on the, on on the Wrangler is, like I said before, you can get this in multiple colors. Rough Rider, basically, you're getting it black. And maybe, and you can get some case hardened stuff too. Well, I don't know what's really case hardened, but case hardened color. Um, there are there are 
other you can get other grips for this but i think you can get way more grips for the for the wrangler because of the the single it works with the single six um let's see and another con for uh for the rough rider is it has this ugly uh safety on on it right here but here are the pros for the rough rider rough rider you can get in the barrel length you can get you know a little two inch the what they call that the barkeep all the way up to 16 inches which is pretty neat also what you can do with this gun too is you could you you can you can run mag loads through this one versus this one you just have to change this change the cylinder cylinder out right here this is a you know for like 30 bucks more i bought this for 30 bucks and now i can run mags here the rough right or the the wrangler you can't that's all you can do is you, you're only going to be running shorts and, and lr on here another i guess another another pro for the for the rough rider is the price this right here 129 dollars and for 30 dollars more you can run, you can run mags. This gun, this gun's going to go for around, you're probably going to around $200. It's like $70 more. So if you're on a, a total budget and you just want to shoot cheap, go to Heritage. But, but you know what? Either gun is, is they're great. Have, for the money you pay, you can't, you can't beat them. The rough ride, the rough rider gets a lot of people. They complain about it. They complain about everything, but you know they only paid one hundred twenty nine dollars for these things. I mean, come on. But people just like to complain. Oh well. And let's see. Are there any other pros and cons? Not really. I mean, I love both of them. So if you have any uh, questions or comments, just leave in the leave them in the comic section. Remember to like, subscribe, share, all that jazz. And remember one thing, the most important thing. Let's go, Brandon. Later, guys. Talk to you later.